Welcome to the Bird on Watches. Today I'm going to be reviewing a wristwatch that I've had for several years. It is a Zizo Maestro. Uh, the Zizo company, they specialize in their own timepieces, of course, uh, pens, eyeglasses, things of that nature. But they, uh, they advertise themselves as a luxury company at an affordable price. Now, their watches are all limited to 500 pieces of each variation, of course. This model, being the Maestro, is solid sterling silver. It's got a very unique shape to the case. And I've had this piece since 2007 I believe and it's been worn I wear it I love it I love the sterling silver uh, this is a numbered limited edition piece all of them are uh, I don't know if you can see this here let me see if I can zoom in a little bit nine two five sterling silver limited edition of 500 pieces and this carries the uh, the ETA 2824 I believe uh, let's see what we have here yeah the ETA 28242 and uh, 3 ATM water resistance it does have a press on case back being sterling silver uh, sapphire crystal of course, the uh, Edda Swiss movement is the uh, quick set date. It's 12, immediately switches date and uh, day and date. Beautifully applied numerals. And uh, the dial has a very unique, beautiful blue hue to it when you get it in the right light, as well as the crystal. The crystal is beautiful, anti reflective crystal. It comes on a very nice leather strap, which I see is very hard to replace. I cannot seem to find this style of leather bracelet out there. The buckle is signed with the Zizo X. Very, very substantial timepiece. This one comes in right at around. 39 millimeters, 39 and a half it be exact. Uh, it wears very well on the wrist. Uh, we'll put it next to my Seiko Samurai here. And uh, see it's much bigger watch there to Seiko Samurai. So yeah, uh, in 39 to 40 millimeter watch as opposed to that 44. We'll do a review on that Seiko Samurai at a later date. But uh, it's very accurate. Uh, it was uh, regulated very well. Um, this one here is running uh, plus minus uh, three seconds a day, which is very good for any Swiss movement. Yeah, all solid sterling silver case and case back, limited edition to 500 pieces. This one being number 127, I believe it is. 127 of 500. Yeah, you can see that little bit of a blue hue there. My ceiling lights hitting the crystal. Beautiful watch. Very nice crown. Very nice signed crown. And uh, this watch here, I do not believe the Maestro is attainable anymore. Um, you may be able to find it out there on a forum for sale somewhere a month. But be aware, the first edition of this series did have a smaller, a smaller Edda Swiss movement in it. Uh, it was a, uh, a model that they would use like in a ladies model of a watch with a plastic spacer in there. Kind of a janky rotor. That was loud and uh, 
I passed that first edition along and managed to pick up this uh, this second edition here and uh, I don't think you can get them anymore but check out Zizo online and uh, they got some beautiful pens beautiful custom pens uh, they have a couple other watches they're really well known for uh, one was being the Commando um, there was the Architect it's more of a dressy watch uh, but overall unique designs by Zizo and I highly recommend their work uh, you're looking for a, a very classy in-house watch with a Swiss movement sapphire crystal precious metals uh, check out Zizo and uh, this here's a booklet booklet here that uh, came with it uh, this uh, the maestro is a music music themed watch it's got the music notes in there and uh, covers a lot of their different time pieces yeah they uh, the Tribune at uh, the Tribune chronograph black and white now I'm not sure if you can find these uh, Zizo models still out there, the Tribune or the Architect, uh, the Air Commando, there's the Air Commando, very nice dive watch, uh, Rolex type of uh, the magnifier there at 3 o'clock, rotating bezel, that's a very nice watch. <clears throat> and they all carry a Swiss out of movement, which a lot of your other high-end watches out there do uh, the incognito has a nice dress watch uh, Tribune and gold rose gold so yeah uh, and yeah pens Zizo does the pens so if you're not familiar with Zizo I suggest to uh, go and check them out at uh, Zizo.com Thanks for a lot for looking guys and uh, please like and subscribe and I got more videos coming, lots of great watch reviews coming up here in the next week. I'm just starting out this channel here up here in the Upper Peninsula of Michigan and uh, got a lot of free time on our hands this time of year. So uh, hope you enjoy the review on the Zizo Maestro. Hope to see you back soon.